Okay guys, today it's uh, at Alhambra on the driveway, so we have a lot of jobs, service and everything, so enjoy watch. Okay, so at Alhambra we start for coding. If you replace indicator or um, the tape inside the steering wheel, this is module where is tape in, then you need to do coding. One year ago I am do coding in this car but I'm look everything what I need code in but I think uh, it's one thing no work no work uh, computers owner say it's actually water leak something on that why no work but I think I make stake last time and I'm look what I need code but probably it is a wrong coding here. No, my fault. It is inside and I need decoding. Take something off. Some cars have computers in the indicator over here. But this car have computers here. I think it's this guy. It is coding on computers in indicator. No, in the steering wheel. That's why car wait for information from indicator and don't know its steering wheel. So we try and do, and uh, we see. Hopefully this one. Hopefully this is no leak and no um, damage on the um, buttons because that costs uh, more expensive. So let's start. Okay, guys, VCDS. So, steering wheel, steering wheel. Okay, so guys, we come to coding number seven. Okay, guys, you look, byte zero, bit six, it is computer, actually in wiper level, so, okay, it's coding out, close. do it okay it's accepting okay and now we start at the engine and we see can buttons work the okay it's coding out are you ready guys it's work okay guys Like you see, it is work, language, we can push Polish. Yeah, it's Polish language. So that's great. So we, it's work. If you change string wheel models, if you change the indicator, if you change um, tape, then you do need, do need coding. But as well looks about decoding. I'm so happy because owner don't need replace the buttons because he think it's this is buttons. Wet juice buttons no work. But he wrong. That great computers help this moment we check fuel injector I'm show you how and I'm sure I'm tell you what be best look okay we check the fuel injector it's 
so engine department. Like you see guys, engine hot. We come in mass values. And right here injector. Wpisujemy injector. Quantum deviation. Quantum deviation. One, two, three, four. Quantum deviation. Like you see, it's here absolutely perfect. First one it's almost zero, next one it's minus 27, sometimes here it's plus and minus 26. It's fuel injector absolutely perfect. What's number it's wrong, I'm ready to tell on my channel guys. If you have over one, plus one, this means it's your fuel injector start slightly leaking. If you have plus two, this means it's, it's bad. Possibility your copper washer under, it is damaged. Then you have uh, no compressor and fuel injector give more fuel. So if you have plus two, first or five plus five or whatever first go there check copper washer then if you have have plus you can try clean clean injector use cleaner but if you have minus this mean it's your fuel injector absolutely dead and probably replace so another thing we happy and uh, it's absolutely perfect but anyway i think it's better do fuel injector cleaner because this is like vitamin if you do one every else then your fuel injector absolutely ever happy all right guys now so we fix the buttons, we don't need to replace, so I'm happy. Fuel injector, you know more about. So just remember, if it is plus, this means it's fuel injector give extra fuel. This means it's probably washer, copper washer, under. Then you don't have compression. Fuel injector give extra fuel to recompensation this Thing. This is possibility as well. If copper wash gone, your DPF have problem. This is as well. Have a look. And quantum deviation. This is no perfect because if your fly double fly wheel <laughs> noise very bad. Possibility your quantum deviation. It's wrong. So you need to think before you do something. Now we go to DPF, we see suit, counter suit, measure suit, pressure, and when last time this car burned DPF. All right, guys, what we see here, counter suit and measure suit. It's good because very close and no much different. Um, we don't know when that the DPF burn, but anyway, tomorrow when I change oil, we um, we burn and we see what's going on. Now it's we find pressure in DPF, so we write pressure here. All right, guys, pressure in particular filter is very high. Like you see, 21. 21, it is Kaution suit, 9 gram. 
and measures with 7 gram. This is very, very, very high, very high uh, pressure. Should be 7. If you have 7, it is perfect. If you come to burn DPF and you have 15, that's all right. But when your DPF burn, you have suit 21, maximum 25. Then your DPF start burn DPF. So I don't like this one. We do, uh, we use chemical, what we use, we use last time and we see what's going on, yeah. Okay guys, now it's full scan. We see what code it is in the engine and a different department. Uh, this is full scan and we see what's going on. Car should be, it's all right if you have a lot code, if somebody before do something and no delay the code. So if you do full scan, then delayed drive couple of days and come back and do scan again and see what come back. If code come back, this mean it is no, it's somebody do make mistake and the no delayed. This mean it's this code you need to find the problem. Auto scan. Gateway. So it's he check everything. Like you see, keep going. Possibility it's uh, a long time. So he check every department. All right, guys, it is IBS um, hot steering wheel. Steering, steering wheel actually it's normal because uh, owner changed the um, type and. Uh, and indicator so probably that's why we have uh, the code but we check we come to steering wheel switch wipers So no important thing. We try clean the code. Code it's clean, no come back. So it's good. Probably when uh, owner do the steering wheel, something happened and code on. One more time we check. It is clean. So it's auto hold, uh, it is problem because it's this button, it is uh, damage. This means it's uh, some juice come on the button and it is sticky. This moment uh, on our, um, my friend no fix that one and every time when start then rip off the handbrake, if you know what I mean, because you can pull. If you start drive, uh, car switch off. We try delay this code, but I think it's anyway back. Back to the future, you know what I mean, when the car start drive. Code is clean, so... And last one left. No, that one it's ABS if I'm good member. No good.
5k guys so I'm delayed every call it's black but uh, no mean it's no comeback uh, fuel injector quantum deviation it's absolutely good uh, you know what number should be what's happen if uh, you have different number if you have plus this means it's uh, clean fuel injector or check copper washer if you have minus big minus like uh, but always first do plus go to fuel injector where is plus if you see plus go first there check copper washer check uh, cleaning then plus always plus um, dpf pressure it's don't like 21 this is quite high if you have uh, eight gram suit no good no good maybe we use the cleaner and we clean dpf um, steering wheel caught it is um, probably last time guy when replace the thing uh, come caught but uh, auto hold probably because button no work and every time when when driver go rip the handbrake uh, because can push off and I'll show you so uh, tomorrow we change oil filters um, brake fluids uh, I'll tell you more about why why I do this why I do that why I do this uh, and maybe more interesting so maybe check the handbrake so all right guys I have sleepers <laughs> but um, like you see it's button no work water or juice come here that's why it's uh, button bed so that's why I think it's auto hold have the code first fix fix button then check the problem so tomorrow we have fun okay guys next day we start uh, Alhambra I'm start replace the filter cabin filter I filter uh, fuel filter and uh, and I tell more about I love fact because cabin filter this is um, absolutely 10 minutes work uh, sorry <laughs> one minute work and uh, very easy so uh, different car like Mazda five hour I'm replace cabin filter uh, Volvo small Volvo five hours change the filter must I remember I need to take out the fuse box every cable and oh, no no so Volkswagen group uh, VAC it's so easy and I'm show you uh, cabin filter I think it's every else replace one time in day else uh, depends as well what road you use if you use uh, like a farm road and plenty dust even every half yells because so dust <coughs> if you town one time on the yells uh, this is catch your air and you nice brief inside i'm always use uh, i'm always use uh, filter ca carbon filter then mold and everything catch as well so one time i else uh, replace uh, the cabin filter guys i'm always use the bosch filter this is mid range uh, quite good price uh, okay quality mm, of course if you want uh, something more expensive because some people want i am use the uh, man but that owner want we do a Bosch filter okay I filled it under the glove box here first we need screw off these guys and take off the plastic okay guys this one it is filter that box I try show you 
we pull and go down. You look how many deer and bass come. But jealous if we. Okay, old filters, new filters. This one looks quite cheap, quite soft. This one's very hard. Very as well. I think it's carbon, but you see how dirty it is. How many mud? So, Hoover and this one. Filter back, like first one, just slide in. So filter inside, slide in. This guy come back, just, and that easy replace the filter in Volkswagen Group. I hope it don't show you how different car because absolutely crazy. So let's finish. That's it. I put back this one and first job done. Okay, air filter is very important. We replace one time I else or even quicker if your road is like farmer road very dust and blah blah mm, it is important because your turbo have heavy life if that filter uh, no work even uh, stop work your engine if be uh, so 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 bad mm, filter <laughs> filter it's quite dirty but no one Magadon so do the job and new filter Okay, filter like you see guys make sure it's round fit very well I'm take this one to make sure have a look inside the turbo here it's okay no much oil just a little bit as well this pipe from here is very important um, this one should be replaced every I don't know how cold because this is old cover and here it's separate separation oil and gas from engine uh, this is very important if block this is possibility your engine uh, start leaking everywhere uh, no smooth work and um, even turbo leaking oil because too much pressure this is old uh, cover or if uh, here it's damaged and uh, no separation oil then oil and the gas come to turbo as well it's no good because uh, you have oil here then no good no good so 
I put back everything. Interesting, very light color, so worrying me. Um, here it's uh, somebody changed the timing belt, so and uh, maybe change for no genuine one or put more water. So I have that tools. We see this is still okay. Okay, fuel filter in diesel. I recommend replace one time IL first because you control anything in fuel do you have spark or spark the dirt from pump and uh, fuel injector diesel very expensive so better do this one time IELTS filter cost no much but fuel injector very expensive diagnostic very expensive so it is better do that one time IL so couple screw come up and first see any dirt inside I always look here like you see it's plenty thing inside but I'm think this that corrosion so we need clean everything everything we need clean so I don't think so it's this is something wrong we take filter out filter looks quite good and everything clean Okay guys, like you see, it's owner of a place made in German, good man, it's replaced that filter, so but we put new. Like you see guys, it's dirt inside as well, where from I don't know, probably last guy when change filter, no clean here just take out inside filter and replace so we clean everything we take our fuel and Okay guys, if you don't have pump, because that engine needs uh, a pressure for fuel return, uh, 5 bar if I'm a good member, uh, so fuel cleaner injector, we put in container, then we put new filter, it is uh, probably mix in the future, but anyway, it is... Um, this work for a moment for just this chemical.
So make sure guys it's is full because later on we have problem for start. Put back everything back. This is one point where it's go. <laughs> on and make sure it's just uh, no drive just uh, work on the chemical so it is quite squeaky noise that engine, if you put the gates, timing belt, sometimes squeaky, it is like from timing belt squeak. About fluid, the cooling system, replace every five years, this is G12. It's already Volkswagen put G13, but anyway, every five years replace. So there's no leak where it's fuel injector because slight leak is all right here. So we heat up, I'm dry, and before we change oil, we burn the DPF. Okay, fuel injector cleaner. Probably you ask what give you that why do and uh, best I did clean uh, So it's uh, fuel injector clean of course it's clean your fuel injector so Every dot hole what you have in the injector? It's clean and fuel pff, Very nice spray if spray nice this mean it is uh, burn very well uh, you have a lot uh, less uh, suit, uh, happy DPF and uh, blah blah. But as well, your fuel injector work quiet. No very crazy, but quiet. Should be work quiet. So that uh, I think I do in my car. And uh, as well, my car streamers, my friends uh, as well always ask, do you want one time I else that clean fuel injector. So next one we change oil between before we change oil I'm burn um, DPF and we see what's going on there. Yeah. Okay we start procedure DPF clean uh, burn so important uh, suit put on the pressure and every temperature I'm sure you okay guys engine department okay engine again problem for focus basic setting and we choose here service regeneration of parts spring filter this is automatic gearbox for manual, of course it's different, you need press clutch, uh, brakes and gas, uh, probably here just brake and gas, we see how on. Operation brake, pedal and acceleration pedal, so we press pedal brakes. Operation brakes pedal At the same time gas mm -hmm. 
Dobra. Serwis regenera jumper Supreme Filter. Ok, guys, serwis regenera jumper Supreme Filter. Press go. Safety cancel. All right, burn start, start run, brake pedal, then full brakes gas. We go to measure suit, see, uh oh. Right, guys. So, cooling system. Why cooling system? When, uh, like you see, it's start burn system. Cooling system. It's very important because check check uh, your thermostat. If thermostat uh, fault, probably your burn no going very well. Next, we have suit. So, count on suit and measure suit. Uh, we see come down what to come down temperature exhaust 741 this is very high and pressure pressure of course this moment engine work so it's pressure high but uh, should be when finish process should be um, like uh, five four hectopascal we see what's going on now we burn and we see what what what's happened Okay, if we think go down, suit, temperature still uh, 700, quite high, and pressure go down, so it's good. A long um, burn, this is already 25 minutes. Like you see, it's counted and measure suit, it's very low, but pressure it's high high as well because RPM go up temperature slightly go down I think it's maybe slow down finish the process so if you burn use VCDS it is before replace the oil first one it's your heat oil heat engine that's important next uh, your DPF go old process no stop between so it should be nice and clean and uh, oil what come to engine actually we replace soon so one time on the yells I think it's this is a great idea because you control control the thermostat you control uh, suit you know temperature it's process start everything everything you know so it's good clean uh, DPF it's finished uh, burn DPF it's finished uh, it's quite good but pressure very high still you know it's uh, RPM come back but like you see it's uh, temperature and everything back to normal 200 this is absolutely good suit uh, count on suit and measure suit it's absolutely good but pressure pressure it's 12 should be minimum four or five for you know no rpm so maybe we use uh, chemical to clean dpf okay, cover down engine cover that guys no look for me for genuine one like original we see all right guys it's life no easy this bolt inside it's damaged no me damage last guy would do its damage should be replace every bolt i'm sorry to honor because one lost here it's it is missing then next one as well it's absolutely shite and this is building construction metal screw 
keep the plastic should be know that so I go pop bigger socket and try screw off this one guys I'm like loose the bolt like you see it's always somebody was before if you put flash then you can drive on the flash make sure it's loose and loose then put flash because drain oil so everything looks good here very nice and uh, under looks like very very good no leak nothing so i am so happy so lose this one lose this one and we see where we go flash okay liquimoli flash you have three flash for liquimoli one it's white this is very like soft that one it's hard so it's black it's another one you put new oil put flash drive 200 kilometers on this product and then change oil we use black one and uh, put in the engine 20 minutes work on this one and clean quite important engine should be hot because that product work very well when it's hot oil So this moment we put flash, don't drive, just work and I'm do another job. Okay, engine flash. Why we use engine flash? Engine flash, this means it's clean inside your engine. Some mechanics say it's just change oil, it's enough. I think it's no, because uh, you see pesting go up, down and have ring. Then the ring have temperature and carbon dirt. Then possibility you lost compression start uh, consumption oil and if you change oil and oil this is absolutely no help so what I'm think every time when you change oil use the flash flash as well clean your engine clean inside clean your testing clean your uh, ring clean everything every 10,000 kilometer 7,000 mile it's good in diesel engine I replace the oil and use flash I'm use liquid moly flash if you want uh, tech 2000 or whatever of course I'm liquid moly no paid <laughs> extra in my pocket so I'm just use because Volkswagen use Ceratec we put Ceratec ceramic protection your engine the liquid moly say it's every 16,000 kilometers, so 40,000 miles, something that I'm say every second oil. Or if you love, like I am love my car, every oil new. What Steratec do? It's help your engine work smooth and nice. A lot of parts touch together in the engine, so smooth work and uh, your engine work quiet and long longer so Ceratec for new oil now we wait uh, half hour maybe 
uh, liquid moly flash wheels, yeah. you look fuel and so probably I need to go to fuel station and buy some fuel that every product what we use need to run shilnik so the same body DPF run shilnik oh, yeah. we see let's start Watch out guy because possibility oil very very hot DPF burn run for Mega gorąco, so hot, so hot, so hot. Okay, we take oil filter, need to replace. So, looks everything all right, so. Field Bosrowski. So it's here small thing to train oil out but anyway if I'm use this one anyway everywhere oil come this is whatever what you use So we put oil here and we put back filter. I see it. Filter new. The bolt, drain bolt as well. Every time when you change the oil should be replaced. So we go up and uh, put Ceratec and oil in the engine. Okay, I clean here. Zawsze tu dużo syfu się zbiera. A od dirt come always here. Sophie Castro. W five W thirty for this engine. Now Ceratek. So if you use Ceratec, you remember that you put less oil, that engine should be four and a half liter or four and three hundred milliliters. So 
we, we, we use less oil. So I put oil here and mix one more time and lay it. Okay, start the engine, check the leak, and we need to put cover back. It's nothing leak, very nice clean. Here as well, we put cover back. I cover it on, and uh, I tell owner it um, bolt it very bad condition for cover and some building construction of the, the the screw is it's have to replace so go ramp down and check oil level if you go to mechanic you remember it some fuel must be in because like you see it's engine run on the flash, engine run for the cleaner, engine run for the burn DPF and um, that consumption fuel. I'm going to buy fuel and we back for game when it's fuel back. Okay guys, it is half, half minimum and maximum, just remember, because diesel have, um, when burn DPF uh, fuel come to oil and the level go up, so better left, don't do put full, just half, absolutely perfect. Okay, engine department is finished, just brake fluid we replaced today, so and um, clean the tools, so left what we need just so. Owner asked for um, check everything, so we check in loose and brakes and everything, and we replace the brake fluid today as well, so let's start. <laughs> and different things. 
screw. It's quite scratch here from card, but everything alright. Okay guys, so brakes quite strange put on, like you see, don't know, I don't take off this one and brakes, pads and the disc is quite good, spring, no brake, no leak from shock absorb, absolutely good, no loose um, arm, it's new, so, but this one as well, you see how many copper grease should be none copper grease here, no copper grease between the disc and uh, hop. But I don't take off because if owner decide, I will, but at this moment, no. So we bleeding valve and put machine for brake. Płynhamulcowy.4, brake fluid.4. Should be one liter enough, but I'm always put more. Make sure it's good flush. Zakręcamy. Tight. Teraz tą końcówkę nakręcamy na hamulcówkę. Now it's that one go to break. I budujemy ciśnienie and we build the pressure. Dobra, powinno być ok. Idziemy do koła. Should be alright now. And we go to win. 10 albo 11. 10 or 11. First make loose. That 11. Try pop. Just head. If no going, then hammer. Pop, pop, pop. So good toes. And valve and just wait. Jak widzicie, pompa pompuje nowy płyn, przechodzi i tutaj sobie ścieka. So like you see guys, pump, pump and brake fluid go here.
Tak myślę, 250 ml na jednym kole będzie ok. 250 ml on one wheel, it should be ok. In system it's less, it's uh, one liter. So that one enough. We go to next wheel. Dobra, słuchajcie, to będzie dobrze. Idziemy do następnego kółka. Zakładamy. Brake cleaner. на другом. So jack up the wheels, check loose.
absolutely perfect. Wheels very tight. Troszkę jakby zbieżność tutaj coś brało. Ok, brake pad, very nice. Brake this, it's all right. We have the spring, no leak, shock absorb. As well. There it's pads. So should be again no grease here between but some mechanic crazy use copper grease maybe toothbrush, I don't know. That crazy. Dobra słuchajcie. No i znowu nawalony na bogato. Powinien mieć zęby tym kaper grisem ludzie kurwa, którzy kładą tyle tego i wszędzie. Mało ważne, sprężyna jest, nie ma wycieków, wszystko elegancko tutaj. Klocki hamulcowe jak widzicie są, z drugiej strony są. Bleeding valve, odkręcamy, luzujemy i spuszczamy płyn i idziemy do następnego. Tutaj jak widzicie też elegancko, marżety już pod autem sprawdzałem. Więc wszystko elegancko. Jedziemy z koksem. Pierw sobie luzujemy. So fast, lost, absolutely great. Oh yes, 
bardzo ładnych nykle są w bardzo dobrym stanie nie ale jak na nasze warunki słuchajcie cieszy mnie to bardzo nie ma wałki No i czekamy. To jak widzicie. Elegancko idzie. Enough. Dobra, wystarczy. Wheels come back. That's how it. it's done. Everything good. Dobra, zakładamy koło. Z tej strony jest ok. Thank you. 
dva kola ešte. Tu vidím smor. Okay, this is machine for brake fluid. I'm ready to screw off the pipe, the thing. I'm use machine. Don't like use pedal because your pump work that way. If you use pedal, then come very far away. Maybe it is rust there, and you damage hill. Better use pump if you have. If you don't, okay, pedal. But this is quite risk. So. New brake fluid in machine, plug, pressure, and keep going. Like you see, it's quite a lot, quite a lot uh, parts. This quite bad, but still okay. Nipple is very rusty. We try, we try. Spring, it's rust over there, so probably on the future crack on this place because rust like rusty, but everything looks okay. Okay, guys, bleeding valve, it's ready loose. I'm so happy when you have very rust bleeding valve soap. Don't pull, push, just pop, 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 pop. If no come, then hammer, snap, snap, snap. Loose, 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 pop, pop, pop. If no loose, then hit gun and hit and try this way. So I'm changing brake fluid over here. Make sure it's loose, nice. Then not the future we don't have problem about. So that's why every two else should be brake fluid replaced, not just hydroscopic as well. You lose the bleeding valve and 
had with him copy. guys this wheels as well cloud copper grease mm, rust and some the spring but spring still all right good bump stop shock absorb no leak and lot rust on the nipples brake pads it's still there so try bleeding this one first make loose Left, right, left, right. It's my own mess. from machine take off screw off and check level Okay, just service uh, left on the dash. We need to decode the restart the service and clean DPF. But we see so hot. Mm, we see what owner said. Uh, can he want the go to uh, shop or online buy because online it's cheaper. So let's go service. Keep this button and. Turn off the press OK. So delayed service, like you see, I already delayed one more time, guys. I'm told you. So press the this button, hold. Then another hand 
turn on then here it's question do you want then press button just that one okay guys like you see Alhambra it's a lot a lot job but it's done clean uh, the DPF the spray one we do uh, next week probably because we have to buy uh, online the spray it's 10 pounds cheaper it's cheaper it's cheaper 10 pounds I know it's not no much but if you buy here this is 50 pound online it is uh, 40 pound I think 40 pound but we have a, we, we need to look so I go around a couple of things uh, make sure it's brakes work everything work no light on the dash and nothing like that so so, so sorry sad Alhambra it's done actually left just the step I have uh, probably next week um, what should be on the future uh, glove plugs in diesel engine Volkswagen third one it is uh, pressure glove plugs very expensive but uh, should be every 40,000 mile uh, replace glove plugs um, gearbox here it's DSG gearbox so every 60,000 mile should be replaced oil gearbox this is very good gearbox but if you worry and change the filter and change the oil if you change oil this gearbox will work a lot a lot mile uh, hold button and you remember guys uh, screw on the cover as well should be should be should be replaced because that's a screw for metal uh, rust and uh, maybe in the future big problem for that so sad it's finished I go home and you remember guys passion love and family just back family see you later